Thank you. Nicely done at 8 You know when you're tweeting somebody or texting or whatever, you see that SMS? Yes. Text. Short message service is what mm -hmm. that is, SMS. Well, you use that part of the word and combine it with ING. Schmishing. It's a scam. <laughs> it's a scam. Be careful. Even if you have not heard of schmishing, you have probably been a victim of it. It is when you get those spam text messages phishing for your personal information. They try to bait you. It's so confusing. So we decided to bring in our computer expert who makes it all easy, Anthony Mangaluza from Pro Computer Service. Thank you so much. Uh, help us. You know, I've seen it and I've almost fallen victim to it myself. How do we know protect it. ourselves? What do we do? Basically, if something is too good to be true, do not click it. For instance, when you get that text message that says, hey, you just want a $100 gift card to yep. Walmart. Mm -hmm. Yes. You click it. Now, all they want to do is they want your credit card information for just shipping and handling for the free gift card that you just won. No one's going to give you a free gift card. Stay away from it. What other things can I do? You know, I was just hearing this thing about the iPhone. That was confusing to me about people. They found ways to get into um, your contacts and make it seem like they're sending something from someone I already know, like my friend or my family. That's right. Now, here's the crazy thing about that. The iPhone is getting the most heat for this and mm -hmm. getting blamed for it. That's actually a flaw in the SMS protocol. So this can affect droids. This can affect iPhones. It can affect any type of phone. Now, the iPhone will be fixing it in the next iOS release, which is coming out in mid-September, but it's very confusing. Do you know what has happened to me with my phone? And this is a droid, but I think it's with other phones, too. S the contact name will change. You ever have that happen? Contact, yeah. The way the way that they send the text, they I can, think. They can, they yeah, can, I knew that. Yeah. I was trying to get a hold of Sean Brace from 97.5. Mm -hmm. His number, his, the name switched to Jody, who we work with here, Jody Harris. So I sent him rude stuff that men send to each other, and finally she goes Look text that. back and says, "What are you talking about?" But it. I know it, it flipped over to somebody else's name. And there's other there's other programs out there. For instance, if you have a jailbroken iPhone, I could actually mimic caller ID. So I could call use your cell phone number to call you. And it's actually it's actually a good party gag to do that. So what's your the term you just used? Jail? Uh, jailbreaking. That's that's when you hack an iPhone and you make it do something that it's not supposed to do. You could load le illegal apps, we'll call it, onto the phone. So, okay, so how do we know if it's if it's fake or not? If we're being schmished? The easiest easiest thing to do is when you click on the link, mm -hmm. look at the URL. For instance, if it's coming from Walmart.com and you click it, it should say Walmart.com. A lot of times it'll be a, a really weird foreign looking. You know, URL right at the top, like your web address link. Across the you just bar. have to be. I mean, I don't found that I almost got tricked by. I got all these emails from IRS.gov. Oh, IRS will never send you an email. They'll never send you a text ever. That That's comes through. That's important to know. Another one that's coming through right now is Netflix. Netflix is saying that they're. It's not the actual company Netflix. They're saying that they're going to credit you membership, and people are falling for that one as well. There's a lot going on out there with this. The key there, what he said, check the URL across that. Uh, right across. And if you're on a computer, you could just highlight your mouse right over the link and it'll show you it before you even click it. Okay. It's just about being careful. Don't give out that bank Don't information. Give it away. Anthony, Great Thanks, Anthony. Thank, thank you. you. It is 822 now. Wow, let's talk about this hiker. The story's yeah.